good. My name's David. I'm going to be one of the EMTs that's going to be going up with you. Over here is my partner, Lisa. She's there, the other EMT that's going to be on the ride with us. All right. I knew that my time was coming up. And uh, I've been uh, so fortunate because it took a lot of pressure off my family to be down here. And because uh, everybody worked and I was home alone most of the time. I started out with home health care but they only came Mondays and Wednesdays and Fridays. And I, I, my health, I just knew that my health was starting to decline. And I just made the ch choice myself that hospice house was the place to be. I'm Roy John Williams. Uh, I lived in Cody country for oh, probably 45 years. My person is just well and well, you know, well treated here. Uh, it's, uh, it's kind of a, a good place where, um, you know, you get great medical care, but um, people can visit you any time of the day, and if they want, your friends and relatives can spend the night. We are here to provide whatever support that people need and what people want. We aren't there to help you die. We are there to help provide comfort in whatever manner that would mean so that you can live until you're no longer with us. Well, Hospice House uh, said that since you're, you know, still in good health, that you, you know, what do you want to do? Something special, but something special. And so I said, well, I would like to go uh, take a four wheel drive. So. Uh, through West Park Hospital, there uh, uh, was able to get a hold of a nice side by side. And I had a nice driver, and he took me on a excursion, and then for, it was about an hour, hour and a half long that we were able to just go down a few trails and just enjoy the day. It's just a wonderful place just to go out and relax and get away from noises and, 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 and just soak in the nature of the lake. You know, it's just one of those, uh, just because you're dying doesn't mean you can't do some of the things that you enjoy doing. And doggone it, John went out and did it. Uh, and I commend them for that. My time is getting short, and I know this, and, and I, I, I've already gone from being able to walk <clears throat> to a wheelchair, and I know where that, from the wheelchair I'll be bedridden, and it'll be time to go. It's, it's nice to have 24 hour care down here. We get three square meals, the lovely meals through the West Park Hospital. We are here to help them with whatever they need. If it's spiritual, if it's emotional support, or if it is treating physical symptoms. And trying to help them work through whatever it is that they really need to work through so that they can have closure and they can feel very comfortable until their, their last days. We try to make uh, the end of life experience as um, wonderful as it can be. The staff is here is fantastic. I can't praise them. They're, they're angels here on earth. I, I truly believe that how fortunate that uh, I have been blessed. I would highly recommend that you bring your people here if, if it's what you ch choose, because they show so much dignity to each other and, and, and the patients. It, once again, I feel so blessed.